I know this is a beautiful pose I'm in right now. Hey guys, welcome back to Gas Tax. I'm Warwick and you're watching Dream Garage Build Out. Today is going to be a Sonic Tools Day. I have my final cabinet arriving from Sonic that's been on back order for about two months. And then I have another package I'm going to be opening from Sonic. Inside the Sonic uh, package is a, the Sonic backpack, which I'll explain to you in a bit what that's for. And then also my Sonic cabinet set has eight different key locks. I want one key for everything. Uh, it's not security, it's more for kids getting in there. Stay tuned and check it out. Well, it is here, finally. Long awaited Sonic trash can cabinet. It fits right in here. Um, so, I guess this video is gonna be a Sonic cabinet video. Is all of these locks are different keys and I wanted one key. So, I'm gonna unbox that. Uh, then I'm gonna unbox this install all of it and go from there so stay tuned well guys this is gonna drive me insane uh, in manufacturing, I know this is a beautiful pose I'm in right now, but in manufacturing, it's very important to keep consistency. And now these are goldish. And now every single one of my legs match except this one. And that's gonna drive me insane. Uh. So there we have it guys, that's my official bench area, so I'm not going to use it for storage anymore. Um, this is a trash can area, which is perfect. This is for paper towels, uh, I don't know where I can find paper towels that big. And that's a nice drawer. One thing about new companies. Um, or just companies in general that do R&D. Consistency in manufacturing is very important. I did manufacturing for many years. Uh, in fabric business, in pillow business, packaging business, uh, display rack business, all the same business. But we manage manufacturing for all of that. And this is gonna drive me insane, which I'll need to fix, is every other leg is silver and this one's gold at the time i ordered this wasn't in stock so it took i don't know two months to get it but now the feet are different it's not a big issue but a big issue is <laughs> i can take feet from the back of any cabinet but all the cabinets are filled now so that's a good two hour project because consistency wasn't I don't know, it was overlooked at Sonic, I believe. It's just, it's a minor detail. It probably saved them a couple pennies to change to that. Or maybe it, it, it cost them more money because it's a better quality metal, I don't know. But no one thought, well, I guess they thought about it, but because my situation's unique, most of it would be covered with the, the skirt. But, that's what you get. So, 
I'll fix that another day. But let's get to unboxing what's in here. Changing all the locks out. And hopefully I got enough locks. So let's open this box and see what's inside. So here are all the same key locks that I requested. Hopefully I ordered enough. If I didn't, uh, I guess I'm a dumbass. And then here is this Sonic Tool backpack. The reason I ordered this is it has all compartments for tools. It's a hard bottom so it can stand up uh, vertically when you got all the tools in there. What I'm gonna do is I am going to make so why did I get the backpack? Well, I'm gonna do two things with it. I didn't buy any tools for the backpack because I got all the tools back there. But what I wanna do is see where tools fit and make two different day bags per se. I wanna make a bag uh, with the tools set up and I'll, I'll, I'll list it out for all tools needed on a track day and then another bag for a oh shit rally day. So if you're doing a, a 500 mile rally one day, I wanna put together what tools I think you need when you do that rally and what tools I think you need when you do a track day. So stay tuned for another video on that, but be sure to subscribe and hit the notification bell so when that video comes up, you'll be able to check it out. Seems like a nice backpack. But for now, let's start changing the keys. a boo-boo in what tools I ordered. Aww. I only have a SAE socket set. I don't have a metric one. That's a problem. I guess I gotta order one of those. I have it in impacts, but that was dumb. <laughs> So this is fun. <laughs> I am using the camera to find everything. <sighs> that doesn't help. This is actually terrible. I don't want to take all these stupid drawers out. Okay, so that seemed to do something. I used a chisel to pry it. Now, the problem is, okay. No, who'd have thought the ratchet wrench wouldn't fit on here? Ha <laughs> ha. 
guys that was uh, much longer than anticipated it does get easier the more cabinets you're doing to replace the locks but it's not too fun but anyways I think that's gonna call it it for today so all the locks are the same now except for this one cuz I either told the guy the wrong number or they shipped me the wrong number I gotta ship those back but yeah thanks for tuning in there's uh, still a couple more videos I gotta do for the Dream Garage build. Um, and then I think I'm gonna call it quits because after that I'm not building the garage. I am actually just improving it. But I think all of this still ties in to the Dream Garage build. That's why I'm still including it on there. I know it's long, boring, tedious, but if you're doing it, believe me, it's 10 times longer. I know there's gonna be questions about everything here. So leave them below. I'm here to just let you know why I chose what and uh, go from there. So thanks a lot. Until next time.